It's 2022. Happy New Year, by the way. And uh, I decided to start off this great year by, you know, whining a bit. Okay, kind of. What I'm really doing here is I'm wishing that we will finally get this one feature in Chrome OS this year in 2022. I think in the year 2022, we Chrome OS users should finally receive the ability to clearly turn on or off auto brightness in Chrome OS. Let me explain. Basically, Chromebooks that come with an ambient light sensor have this ability to automatically adjust the screen brightness. The sensor basically detects how bright or dark the environment in which the Chromebook is being used is, and it adjusts the screen brightness um, accordingly. Examples of Chromebooks that have the ambient light sensor, and as a result, this auto brightness feature includes the Lenovo Duet, the Pixelbook Go, and a few others. I don't think there are a whole lot of Chromebooks that have this light sensor, but there are a few out there. And yes, in case you're wondering, the feature is sort of similar to how auto brightness works on your smartphone, which you might have mixed feelings about. I certainly have mixed feelings about how auto brightness works on smartphones nowadays, but uh, you know, the feature itself could seem usable to certain people. In practice and with real life settings though, I have found this auto brightness feature to be a little too sensitive on Chromebooks. With my Lenovo Duet, for example, it is not at all unusual for me to be trying to use it in a bright room and to have the screen get dimmer and dimmer because the auto brightness is kicking in for some reason. As you can imagine, seeing your Chromebook screen get dimmer and dimmer as you try to use it in a bright room can get annoying real quick, almost as annoying as, by the way, the construction that started outside of my house just as I started to record this video, which is just you know great timing on everyone's part, but we will move on. Back to the auto brightness feature, it's a, it can be a little bit annoying and it's not really working for me and it's a feature that I would turn off if I could, which leads to why I'm whining here. There are unfortunately no clear ways to turn off or on auto brightness within Chrome OS right now. This means that there are no auto brightness related settings in the display or power settings, and no such options within the notification area either. Based on the UI and the settings and the lack of any mention of auto brightness, you know, one can be forgiven for thinking that there is no auto brightness adjustment ability with any of these Chromebooks and that you're just imagining the screen getting dimmer and dimmer as you try to use it within a bright room. Fortunately though, if you're experiencing these auto brightness problems with your Chromebook, you're not imagining it and I'm not imagining it, Chrome OS developers have confirmed that this is indeed a feature that exists within Chromebooks, and they also have given us a way to turn off auto brightness. Apparently auto brightness gets turned off whenever the user manually adjusts the brightness of the screen, which almost sounds like a solution, except it isn't. Firstly, manually adjusting the brightness doesn't permanently turn off auto brightness, nor does it permanently turn off the auto brightness within the session if the said Chromebook sleep, goes to sleep or reboots or shuts down, auto brightness is automatically turned on again. Secondly, there are plenty of mixed reports on Google forums, Reddit pages, and whatnot uh, that suggest that manually adjusting the brightness does not always turn off bright, auto brightness within Chrome OS. I have also experienced this sort of inconsistency with my Lenovo Duet as well as my Pixelbook Go. There have been a few instances where I would manually adjust the brightness on either of those devices and I'd go back to doing something and then for some reason the auto brightness will kick back in and the screen brightness will start adjusting and I'd be like, but but I just but I but I just turned it off, didn't I? I just manually adjusted the brightness, but and then I'd have to go back and manually adjust the brightness again. It's it, it gets really annoying really fast. Now thirdly and most importantly here this solution that Chrome OS developers have given us to turning off auto brightness doesn't really help me in regards to being able to confirm what the current status, status of auto brightness is within my Chromebook. Manually adjusting the brightness doesn't tell me, hey, auto brightness is off now. There's nothing that notifies me that, hey, because you just manually adjusted the brightness right now, auto brightness on your Chromebook has been turned off. Like there's there's no notification of that. There's no setting of that. There's There's no message of that. It's very much guesswork. You manually adjust the brightness on your Chromebook and just hope that it's off. Maybe it's on, maybe it's off, who knows? The Chromebook probably does, but we're not gonna tell you. Which I don't know about you, but that feels a little bizarre to me. Like, just, you know, just tell me. Just tell me whether or not auto brightness is on or off. You know, you, you could at least do that. Having now complained about this issue for a little bit now, the question becomes, what would I like Chrome OS to do about this? And, you know, my, my desire here is very simple. I would just simply like Chrome OS developers to give us a setting, a section within the settings or a section within the notification bar that simply and clearly lets us turn off or on auto brightness. 
And I really don't think I'm asking for anything too complicated here. I mean, this is a feature, this is the kind of setting that you find on most other devices. For example, this is a setting that exists in Android devices. The auto brightness feature called adaptive brightness in Android can easily be turned on or off within the Android settings. And it's a very similar case with iOS devices and even Windows devices. All these other non-Chrome OS devices and OSs have a setting that lets users confirm whether or not auto brightness is turned on or off on their device and that lets them turn on or off auto brightness on their device. Like it's, it's such a simple sounding feature. Why can't we have this in Chrome OS? And to be crystal clear here, I'm not saying we should get rid of this auto brightness feature from Chromebooks. It's not my cup of tea, but there are plenty of people out there who I think find this auto brightness feature to be useful. There are people out there who have a tendency to leave their Chromebook screens at a brighter setting than they need to be. Having this auto brightness setting, uh, brightness setting kick in and dimming dim the screen from time to time is a good feature to have for them. It's a good battery saving feature. Like it's, I understand the value that this feature can have to some people and I'm not trying, trying to get rid of it. All I'm saying is that we, the users, should have the ability to turn this feature on or off and to be able to confirm that this feature is either on or off. And I get that some longtime experienced Chromebook users, those who are very much a fan of Chromebook developers might be saying, right, you know, hey, if you feel this strongly about this, why don't you make a Chromium bug? or post up a Chromium bug and, and try to make it a number one priority for Chromium developers by getting, garnering support for it or something like that. And, you know, I could do that, sure, but uh, the reality is others have made this sort of effort to try to get this kind of feature um, implemented within Chrome OS and nothing has really happened. And the sad thing is my complaints about the Chrome OS auto brightness settings or the lack thereof have been around for a while. I'm not the first one to come out with, you know, comments like this. I've seen comments like this being posted on Reddit, Google forums, and on other uh, websites for the past few years now, for the past at least three years now. And I've seen no progress. I mean, developers finally gave us an ability to turn off auto brightness, I suppose, with the manually adjusting uh, the brightness method, but it, you know, it's not good enough. Um, I feel they could do a little bit more. And it, it just seems like Chrome OS developers, for them, this, this currently isn't a priority, which I think is a real shame. Chrome OS developers often add all these like cool and different intricate features that some d users will definitely take advantage of and some others will definitely not benefit anything from because they just won't care for it. And you know, here we have an auto brightness setting, a clear feature that I think all of us Chrome OS users can develop, can benefit from. And you know, developers just aren't looking at it, which I think is a shame. So here I am resorting to wishing within a YouTube video that most people probably aren't gonna care about. <laughs> it's probably not gonna affect any change whatsoever. But here I am wishing that Chrome OS developers will finally add some kind of auto brightness setting that lets us clearly turn on or off auto brightness within Chrome OS and that they'll do this in 2022. Now I say this, but knowing them, I wouldn't be shocked if we get to Chrome OS version 150 in the year 2023, and I'll, I'm still out here complaining about how we still don't have a proper auto brightness setting within Chrome OS. So yeah, thanks for coming to my TED talk. <laughs> um, you, you know, this is one of those things that's been bothering me for a while, and I just thought, you know, beginning of the year, we might as well get this off my chest while, you know, we're at it, good at an opportunity as any. My new year resolution for this year is to get this channel to a thousand subscribers, and I hope to do that with not this kind of ranty, whiny videos, but with more tech tutorials, more tech reviews, more of that helpful and informative content that I think uh, tech audiences tend to appreciate. So. Uh, Thanks for watching this video and I promise my next one will be less whiny.